morning third grade and happy Wednesday April 15th today is National Banana Day so if you have one have one for your snack today it is also National McDonald's Day but for us right now it's only through drive-thru it is also National Rubber Eraser Day who knew right uh, so when you're using your pencils today think of that eraser that's so important at the end of the pencil it's also National Laundry Day, so gather up that dirty laundry, throw it in the washer, and help your family out today. And finally, it is National American Sign Language Day today, so use your sign language to tell your family, I love you. Okay, let's get on with today's assignments. First, we're gonna start with reading. Reading today, we are going to do a review of Sarah Plain and Tall, both comprehension and vocabulary. What you're going to need to do is get on to Zoom. We're going to have a Zoom meeting. We're going to actually have two. So you can choose which time you want to review, either 10 o'clock in the morning or 2 o'clock this afternoon, whichever works best for you and your family. I sent the information to your families via email on Tuesday. So you can get that information and log into the Zoom meeting. It also tells your family in that email that you're going to need to have, if you're on a laptop or a desktop computer or even a Chromebook, have two tabs open up at the top, one for your Zoom meeting and then the other for the Kahoots because we're going to play a Kahoot game as a review. So make sure you have a tab open up to the link I sent in the email to your family yesterday. And that's how we're going to play. So you're going to have to juggle between the two um, tabs at the top. Now, if you have a second device that you could use, you could be you could have the meeting on one and the um, Kahoot game on the other. You could download the Kahoot app onto a cell phone or a tablet and you could play that way as well. You'll just need to log in with the code that I give you at the beginning of our meeting. And when you log in, after you put the code in, you have to put your name in. I need you to put your real name so that I can give you credit for participating in this activity. So make sure you use your real name. Okay, so that's what we're going to be doing in reading tomorrow. So make sure you log in to Zoom, either at 10 or two, and be ready at that time, have it set up so you can get onto Kahoot. And then we'll juggle back and forth and then you'll be able to see uh, the progress on my screen on the Zoom meeting. Okay, so that's what we're gonna be doing for reading tomorrow. We're gonna to be reviewing together. Spelling, on to Spelling City. Practice those words, be ready for your test on Friday. Math, probability, you did a really good job working on it so far yesterday. So let's continue, we're gonna go back to Seesaw, we're gonna watch a cute little video, and then you're going to do a marble activity to practice probability. Make sure you hit that green check mark up at the top to submit your work. And then you'll go back, you'll do workbook page 87, on the website by filling in the Google form that is next to it, okay? Religion, there was a little mix up today, well, from yesterday for today's work. For some reason, today's work showed up on Seesaw yesterday. So some of you finished it, which is fine, not a problem, but make sure, even if you finished it, make sure you go back and read pages 136, 137 on our website. And if you didn't do the poem, head on over to Seesaw and do the parish acrostic poem on Seesaw. And again, hit the green arrow or the green check mark to complete that activity, okay? Um, and make sure you turned in your sunrise if you didn't. I know a couple didn't, so make sure you do that, which was yesterday's work. Some of you did this, but not yesterday's work. So it was a mix up, that's okay. Just make sure you turn it in. For English today, we are doing some adjective review games. There are a couple little pictures. And what you're going to do is you just click on those pictures. It'll take you to some games just to practice. So spend a little time practicing those adjective review games. For art, you're gonna, you can go to the Art for Kids Hub link on our page, or the um, YouTube video. And you're going to be drawing the empty tomb for Easter. So go ahead and try that out if you'd like. If you finish it, send me a picture of it so I can post it. Um, I think 
that's pretty much it for today. So the big part of the day would probably be the reading, us working together. We'll probably be together about 45 minutes to practice that. And um, then a little bit of time on Spelling City, which I know it shouldn't take you too long. Um, the math also should not. Some of you already did the religion, but if you didn't, that shouldn't take you very long. And the games and the drawing are um, are pretty much, they're fun, but you're going to be doing something educational as well during them. I want to say how proud I, uh, I am of your work yesterday on Seesaw. You did beautiful work on your Sarah Clean and Tall scenes. Head on over to the um, photos link at the top, the tab at the top, and there are some pictures of your work there so you can see the scenes that each other created. So you did a really nice job with those. And you also did a good job with your math there too. So I can see that you're getting the hang of using Seesaw more. So good job, keep up the good work. All right, until tomorrow, I will see you later. Um, if you need anything, you know how to get a hold of me. And like I said, until tomorrow, I love you, bye.